Today I will be showing you how to change the water filter on a Whirlpool refrigerator. The water filter that I will be using is the HDX brand and the model number is the FMW-2. This is a fairly standard type water filter. What you'll need to do is to figure out which filter you should use for your particular refrigerator, open it and the inside there should be a sticker here. If you get this model number and then go to Google, search for that model number uh, and put filter in, it should show you which one. But again, this is a fairly standard type uh, works for a lot of different refrigerators. And the concept that I'm gonna show you should work on quite a few models. So make sure you Google your particular one to see exactly which filter you should use. So I have both doors open. And if you just grab onto this plastic piece, you should be able to pop it straight out. There are clips on the side here, on this side, and right here, it goes into there. I'll pop this off here. Pull hard and then it will release. Underneath here is some stuff that I will clean up as well and be right back to getting this filter out. The filter here has a black plastic cap on it. It can be sometimes hard to turn, but once you take this black plastic grill off that was on here, it makes it easier to grip it with two hands and just rotate it counterclockwise. And then it will release and you can pull this right out. This plastic part here, you just slide off the end and you'll be putting it on the new filter. So this can be thrown away. After about six months of use, they recommend changing them. You can kind of use your best judgment if the water starts to taste funny. So you take the new filter, which is here, it has a black plastic cap on it, and there are two rubber gaskets. Pretty simple, you just take this black plastic thing, slide it on the end here, put it back into this, until it fits in and then turn it clockwise until it stops. Now that the filter is in place, it's time to put the black plastic grill back up. So you line it up with the circle here and just there's little uh, pegs in the back here. Line up, snap it into place. Do the same thing there, snap it into place and then close the door. And the next step is gonna be putting about five gallons of water through the system to flush out the filter and get it ready for regular usage. Once you have your new filter in place, press and hold this button for your reset. Every model might be slightly different, but generally there's a button where you can reset your filter. So you hold it for a few seconds and then run about five gallons of water through. I take the water, save it in a bucket and give it to the uh, lawn, but you can do whatever you'd like with your water. Just don't start using it until you've put about five gallons through. Otherwise you're gonna get charcoal taste in your water. I've got the ice maker here filled with the old ice that was made with the filter that was old and it doesn't taste very good, kind of freezer burned flavor. So I'm just gonna put it here in this planter. Let it just kind of melt and water the plants because I don't have my watering system in yet. So that is how to change a filter on a Whirlpool refrigerator. Like, comment, subscribe below. Let me know if you have any questions. Thank you.